Okay. <laughs> Three, two, one. Oh boy! Oh boy! Here we go again. again. <laughs> We're back. We tricked you. We're actually playing again. Uh, just a little bit more. Cause there's a little bit more uh, rolling out. We're just, of... we're just we're just doing a downtime. No just combat. Downtime. We're just leaving on that massive cliffhanger. We're going back into the cliffhanger. But it's up to yourself now, David. What do you want to do with the the door that you just find? <laughs> then we'll just do an hour of David being like, Nah, I don't want to do anything. <laughs> I'll ignore it. Parts of the barrel with uh, the head of no, I'm not doing that. Um, can, can you share your screen, Gabriel? Yeah, sorry. Uh, Thank you. I am going to telep right. telepathically tell everyone on the ship. A door has appeared, and it's looked suspiciously similar to Ramsey's door. Will that wake me up, Gabriel? Or you probably hear it in your dream. I mean, you, you, somebody else might. Room. I'll have a terrible dream. But everyone else is around you, right? They might wake you up. I mean, everyone... they, might, they might, yeah. I, yeah, I mean, it's up to yourself. Like, oh, yeah, you I'll got... definitely uh, wake up Fatima if she doesn't. Oh, okay. Well. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Yeah, it's up to you. Like, you've got such a high con, it's kind of like, well, you could just sleep through anything, I feel like. Yeah. High con, but... You know, I'll, I'll, okay, so Mira wakes me up and I'll just be like, oh, I had an awful dream that Ramses was on the ship. But Ramses is on the ship, we should go right now. <laughs> <laughs> what? Hello, deck, guys. Hello, anyone? You can talk back. Give us like two seconds. I know I can talk back. I'm telepathic. <laughs> ah. For that. And I'm grumpy. <laughs> I didn't no, know you were telepathic. Hey, this isn't the time for discussion. Come on, grumpy head. Um... While I'm waiting for everyone, I'm gonna take like a little bit of that beer. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm doing like I'm annoyed to be awake. Groans, but I'm doing it telepathically so David can hear me. <laughs> <laughs> but you can just, you can just hear like. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll I'll take Fatima's hand and start leading her down down to the my only hand. Yeah, yeah, your only hand. Rip. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Rip. Uh, <laughs> ripped off. Uh, yeah, you can start that. Uh, <laughs> well, it was like like melted off melted or something. Off, that's true. Right, Bina, you maybe don't want to come down, but I also don't want to leave you on your own. Um, Judgment call. You do you, babe. She's, she's okay. She's there with Malakra. Uh, I'll, uh, yeah, I'll take a... Uh, you know what? I think I'll, I'll, I'll stay by the, I'll, I'll stay by the stairs with Malakra. Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. Malakra's like, no problem. I got a, a is she allowed? Uh, margaritas. Beer only. No beer, margarita. Beer only. Okay, so bring the beer up and we can get her a glass of beer. Don't worry, we can shoot okay, a glass but, of beer. But we gotta deal with this first, okay? Oh, okay, right, sorry. Uh, <laughs> I'm on a I'll just, I, can I just, I'll just like, like, use my, I, like, my, I do have just telekinesis. I'll just pick up a beer and just pass it up the stairs. <laughs> like, oh, I can, I can, I can just, I can just match it, or I can just, Tele telekinesis one up there. There we go. We got the dancing beer. Grab the dancing beer, girl. You earned it. You deserved it. Slaying mountains, literally. Congratulations. <laughs> that is your mountain slaying beer right there. Um, okay. Beautiful. <laughs> uh, as is all going on, David, how much do you use a sip of the beer? Um, have we how much is a si how much of a small drink you take? Are you having like a full drink of it, or are you just oh, taste knowing what I'm like? I probably just drink a full glass of it. So. Okay, cool. Well, they're all coming down. You're kind of chugging it back. Uh, give me a con save. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> oh, I put my dice in there. One second. Mm -hmm. Yes. Me. Mm -hmm. Okay. I like the idea of casting foresight before going out for another drink, so I don't get as fucked up. <laughs> That's like so obsessive and I'm so fucking over the top. It's like godly <laughs> stuff just that you're doing. Like, I just think I'll do a bit of foresight for this drinking session. It's an unnatural twenty. <laughs> okay, beautiful. You're fine. Um, <laughs> it's strong. It is strong stuff, but like really beautiful. Very. Uh, the kind of the heat in it is is great in this moment. After even though you're like wrecked by heat there not too long ago, it, mm. it is soothing. It like soothes all your muscles and helps you relax. But you more embrace the 
the uh, the alcohol rather than letting it take over you and eat it. Nice. Thank you very much. Right. So the others eventually come down uh, into this room. Are you stepping into the room? Or are you just kind of peering around David's massive form in the in the space. Does David have wings? Yeah, he's an, he's a Solaire. He's a oh yeah, I guess yeah. Angel. He has all of the features that they have. I think they have wings, do they? They do I have was wings. They just like flew flew by like. Pretty sure but they are. You there. should see their their fucking stat block. It's ridiculous. I can see yourself though if you want I'll to be, have wings I'll or not. Be, I'll be wingless solar. I'll have like a disc that flies around me instead, and that's what keeps me afloat because that's cute. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> <And> it's just <laughs> floating. <laughs> <space. laughs> I want cute. <laughs> I'm keeping just visually my bunny ears because I want to distinguish myself. Oh, wait. <laughs> you oh, they do have fucking. You oh, your bunny ears come up in like a halo. They meet in the center. They just touch tips. Cute. So you got the oh. solar. The solar knows if it hears a lie. If someone lies to you, very cool. I can only do. I can only do that telepathically. That is so useful for fucking Ramses. Mm -hmm. Thank you for reminding me of that. <laughs> oh, you can uh, teleport. teleport. Uh, oh, I can. Uh, Sorry? There's a chance if they hit people with their bow that they just die. <laughs> oh, that's the, yeah, the slaying bow thing. Mm. Uh, um... It must succeed on a DC 15 constitution saving throw or die. <laughs> if oh, the target is a creature that has 100 hit points or less. So once it's below 100 hit points, you can just kill it outright. Yep. Yep. Uh, so you make your way down into this room. Uh, you can see the... Uh, strange, out of place wooden door in the porcelain, like embedded into the porcelain wall. It's got a small knocker for a handle, like a kind of ring for a, a, a handle. Uh, is it yourself? What do you want to do? Are we ready to do this? Do we have anything that we should prepare before we talk? Are we, are we going in? You want uh, to go in? Do you want to knock? Do you want him to come here? Because I think he may be unbound. But if he wanted to come in here, why wouldn't he? Maybe can't it's like just, vampire can't, rules. I don't know. Can't we just board up the door? <laughs> no, can, we, can we just like? No, yeah, uh, we could probably uh, set it on fire, but like, I never like, stopped him. What, can sorry? we like? Can we just talk to him? Can I put my ear, my good ear, <laughs> against your, the your door? Ear. Your one ear. Oh, wait, my ear. Your ear. I'm uh, trying to listen and see if there's anything. Yeah. Give me a give me a perception check. He's gonna oh. stick one of his gross tendrils in your ear. No, he's not. Stop it. <laughs> I, I cast invulnerability on myself before I forget. That's so fair. Oh, I rolled a 19. I don't think I have plus anything to that. Of course, yeah, no, it's just 19. Uh, Alrighty, let me just get something up here. Um, yeah. Stop this music. You can do resurrection three times a day. Oh, you can control the weather, David. No, I can't. Can you? What? Yeah, once a day you can control the weather. Oh, I don't get the legendary actions. Uh, uh it's not. Wait, oh, so you don't get the teleport, the searing burst, or the blinding gaze. That's right. But this is this is under innate spell casting. It's not oh. under legendary. Oh shit! It's it's not even oh, under it's, actions. It's it's, it's like a, yeah. it's like abilities. Yeah, the innate spell casting. Once per day, you can commune, whatever that means, and you can control weather three times a day. You can blade barrier, dispel evil and good, and resurrection. And at will, you can detect evil and good, and you can do invisibility. Love self on, self only. Self only. That's fair. So Unlimited. I'm trying to find the uh, the music that I wanted for this. I just can't remember which one it is. I think it's this one. Yeah, there we go. That's the one. That's the ticket. Uh, 19, Mira. Yeah. yeah. Uh, as you bring your ear to the door, uh, you hear 
it sounds like uh, a music box on the other side of the door. Mm -hmm. um, but the music box, with each kind of click you know, of the thread moving through it, uh, it sounds like a single cry or laugh of a child um, being emitted through the, the each, each tune that plays. Um, I need to make me a wisdom saving throw, please. Mm. Those are the ones you're hard about, aren't they? I have a uh, two. Two of the magical uh, effect. Uh, I'm going to say no, because it's a god. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> uh, that's a 19, but I can use my saving faith to add, I guess, just too too bad because there's uh there's only two allies that i can see right now uh, got, we've got david patema i assume you don't count uh titus i mean if you have some ally and he's weird then yeah oh is luke down here uh luke Pan will be uh he, he can be i guess bring him down because you get plus two if luke pans in sight as well have have Luke. Yeah, I, I, get, I get plus one for each ally in it that I can see. You know what? I'll need you to roll me a d20 at luck roll. If it's 11 or higher, you can see Luke Pan. Okay. okay. Uh, uh, another 19. Okay. okay. So you can see Luke Pan as well, like nosily coming around the corner. So you're adding four to this, right? Oh, yeah. So it's uh, 23 then. 23. Uh, unfortunately. It is still a fail. What? Uh, Do you still have the bardic inspiration from uh from the game? last session? From the yeah, you gave no, me one. I never used it. It only lasts ten minutes, I think. Does it? I think in the new one D and D, it lasts an hour, but it's only ten minutes. <laughs> I had no idea. I thought it was like ah, oh, damn. Maybe it changes at higher levels. I'm not sure, but I don't think so. God damn it. Sorry. Okay. Um. First thing uh, you notice is the music stops. Oh. Uh, you can't hear That's good. the music. Uh, you pull your ear away from the door, and there's a stickiness as you pull your ear away, and you realize that your eardrum has completely burst, and there's a splattering of blood on the door that comes away in tendrils as you pull your ear away completely smothered in blood, and you're completely deaf, and you can't hear anyone or anything. Uh, you take oh, 30 points of psychic damage. Invulnerable. Yeah, yeah, I don't take any damage. But you're, yeah, that, we agreed that was about 10 minutes has passed, right, since you got... No, but I, I just said I mean, well, you can't, can't, Oh, sorry, okay, no, then you're fine then. No, no psychic Oh, damage. she didn't go deaf. Um, you're still deaf. Uh, oh, still still deaf. hurt. <laughs> Uh, oh my goodness. Um, sorry. So we have to talk to Mira telepathically. Uh, There's only one ear, no? Oh, you're just deaf and... Oh, Our other ear got shot off. I suppose... I, I suppose that ear still can hear, though, right? Yeah. I assume I'm completely deaf, though, right? Am I? Uh, like, both ears. Currently, just for... Yeah, yeah, you've got no hearing in one of your ears, but um, for maybe about six seconds, you are deaf completely. Um, oh, did you smell food? Or did she just fart? Okay, <laughs> sorry. Uh, as you do uh, pull away, yeah, blue. Uh, something smells pooey or farty, uh, but hopefully it's on uh, seriously. I hope, I hope it was blue. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> um, as you do uh, pull away, uh, you see now just standing by the door a small little boy with a cloud of like afro hair. His hair, his face is slightly transparent. He's got big blue eyes, uh, little gold bracelets, um, and a small kind of like a sarong around his waist. And he kind of just looks up at you with his big eyes, just like, uh, Hi. Are you going to save me? Hello. 
Can I stab the little boy? <laughs> oh, <laughs> no! You can if you want. Yeah. Can I try and stop her stopping the little uh, boy? You can try, yeah, you can certainly try if you want to. Uh, <laughs> give me both uh, gifts initiative checks. Or no, give me, oh, contested, okay. give me a contested either acrobatics or strength check between the two of you. Sure. Or if you prefer, Patema, you can make a an attack acrobatics roll. Acrobatics or strength or acrobatics or athletics? Actually, you know what, Patema, you can make me an attack roll, and David, you can make me the acrobatics check to see if you can get in sure. to redirect it. 29 for me. 29, okay. Oh! <laughs> um, I, have a, I have a plus 17 and I rolled 13, so I got a 30. Oh, oh wow. So, David, <laughs> even with your lightning reflexes, Patema is already there. Like, she's so... I'm so ready to stop so a child. So ready to kill a child that not even you can stop her in this moment. Uh, <laughs> she moves at like such insane speeds, and all of a sudden the um, Guandao pain is in the belly of the boy. Uh, red blood starts to pour out down your blade onto the floor, and they're like, Poof! they cough blood, blood drips down from their lips. Oh, why did you do that to me? I panicked. I just woke up. Oh, do, it, do you need the damage from that, David Gabriel, yeah, or does it matter? Yeah, give me, yeah. give me the damage. Uh, no, 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 Oh wait, plus plus five is um Oh yeah, okay. Plus plus plus, plus five. What yeah. what the number did I say? Twenty five, so thirty damage. <laughs> thirty damage. Cool bula. Same uh, as my attack roll. Amazing. Uh yeah, you stab them in the in the belly and they kinda hold their stomach and they're like, Oh that wasn't very nice. Uh, and they just start to pull it out of their stomach uh, away from themselves and then they just hold it there, their hands there, uh, blood still pouring up through their fingertips. Uh, they don't seem to be like passing out or anything, but they, they just seem to be taken aback. Yeah, see if you stab a child and you do that much damage and they're fine, then that's not a child. Is that how that works? <laughs> Yeah, you, um, Mira, as you, you kind of look around as well, your hearing eventually woof, comes back. Um, you see the child again now bleeding on the floor. Where the, the fuck did he come the, from? The, the, oh, the child just collapsed on the floor, is he? Wait, what? No, he's just is still it... standing there on the floor, just looking at his belly. Oh, okay. <laughs> I should move. Oh, what are you doing here? Sorry. I just, I just was, I was hanging out with my friends, and then I came here, and then I got stabbed, and now you feel really bad. Uh, I'll put my big palm onto his belly, and I'll cast, or not cast, I'm using the third of my four-day healing touches from being a solar um, to heal him. One second. Roly, roly, roly. Forty points. Oh, sorry, forty-four points of um, healing. What's your name, little fella? Uh... I'm sorry about my friend, and I glare at her. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Uh, Unicorn children. <laughs> my name is Wandel, and I'm just a little boy just hanging out. Is he lying? Because I just know and think No, no kid lying. says I'm just a little boy hanging out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's lying. Um, okay. I'll, I'm gonna cast Detect Evil and Good. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, did you just did you just heal him? Yeah. yeah, it's not gonna make a big difference. It's a gesture of faith. Uh, he is 
the purest form of evil. Holy shit, he's evil! I okay, I'll evil. stab him again. You're evil. Ah! <laughs> he just stabs him again. Uh, <laughs> he just takes it. Uh, I'm going to stab him as well. <laughs> oh my god, I'm not just stabbing this child. Well, I'm going to slice him. I'm going to try and like... Sorry, you're slicing him, not stabbing him. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So does he give off the same energy as Ramses, or is he like a different kind of evil? Uh, you can give me an insight check if you like. Sure. I I did a no, I did twenty nine damage this time. Twenty nine damage. Okay. That's natural one. So. <laughs> Seems like a boy. They're just stabbing a child right now. <laughs> They're all getting mm. it. Mm. I trust them to do this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So you twenty nine. How much damage you do, David? I do an extra five uh, d eight worth of um, radiant damage. So. Oh, sorry, 68. So, one second. Okay. Uh, <laughs> um, I do 93 points total. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> Fuck. Uh, with that, you come down with your blade. Potema stabs them. You just go straight across with your blade, and their head just slides off, and they vanish. The last thing you see is his eyes staring up at you, David. Uh, I need you to make me a constitution saving throw. Okay. Amazing. I'm good at those now. 28. 28. Uh, you're fine. Uh, do you take half damage? No, you do not. Uh, for a moment, you feel a tug at your, your very soul. Like your soul is being trying to be dragged out of your body. Uh, soul cage! <laughs> no, no. <laughs> So catch myself. <laughs> um, <laughs> you, you decapitate him. His head falls off. The body vanishes. Does the head also vanish? Yeah. Okay. I knew I was. I knew I was right to stab that child. Yeah, as it turns out, you were right. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm gonna drink the young kids. I'm gonna drink a martini. Yes, I think we all need a bit of a martini. Uh, uh, give, give me some. And you see the like the hairs of uh, Titus wiggling out towards your direction to get the martini. I'll pour a martini on him. Yes, yes. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, the door remains closed. I'm not quite sure if this means whether or not he wants to talk to us or. I, mean, I don't know what he could possibly want to talk about, but I I mean there's a big knocker on the door. <laughs> I presume I presume Ramses wants us to knock. Um Well I, yeah. I think I went deaf when I tried to listen in, so um Yeah, because he doesn't he just wants us to knock. It's Ramses. He has to do everything fucking weird. I mean, I can knock in case it's trapped. Uh, I don't know. I won't take maybe, um, maybe David, because you're a big... David, you're super muffled. I'm not talking. Oh. Well, <laughs> oh, then you are just making some sound. Oh, okay. Um, maybe we should get David to, to knock, because he's a big fucking angel man now. Okay. Well, no. Um, I'm saying if you get hurt, then... uh, yeah, okay. Uh, uh, I'm gonna fully armor up just to be sure to be sure. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, do you yeah. still have your armor in angel form? Yeah, I can keep all my equipment because it's shape oh, okay. Nice. And so, yeah, I'm a fully armored up angel boy. <laughs> and <laughs> I'll open the door. I'll knock them, knock them the door, knock them the door. Okay, so so it's like it's like a, a handle that's like a knocker, basically. It's like you know those kind of old like, uh, say a door in a castle. Instead, it wouldn't have like a regular handle or like a, a circle. It would have like a a ring, basically. Yeah. You can you can knock with the ring if you like. Uh, okay. So as you do, you grab the ring, you pull it up, and just as you're about to bring it down, there's no momentum or no weight in your hand anymore, as you push forward and you're in total darkness. Uh, only oh. your hand is about, uh, you know, a foot away from a door that's right in front of you. Um, but all around you is darkness. 
except for the floor, which has a very, very soft glow to it. Uh, the floor is made of white stone. When you look down, you can see all of the stone is made up of it's, it's carved out human faces uh, with hollowed out eyes and hollowed out open mouths, which are filling with a black liquid. Um, does, does David disappear to us? Or? Yeah, he's not there anymore. Uh, if I try and like telepathic, telepathically speak, does can I hear them? Uh, or can they hear? You have to be on the same plane, right? For tele- or you have to be within a certain distance. Oh yeah, you have to be within 120 feet, I think. Okay, you're not 120 yeah. feet from anyone anymore. Uh, I do need you to make me a charisma saving throw, though. Lovely! Okay. One second. Better read so much more fucking... Yeah. That's what I thought. I saved all the time. Very, very nice help. Um, that is... Maths, maths. Just one second. Let my brain... Mm-hmm. Yeah, there it is. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, that is 31. 31? Oh, you're fine. You're okay. You've been here before. Oh, I can... Um, um, no, never mind. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm just going to read the description yeah. for something. Uh, okay. Oh, okay, no. Um, if I... Can I... Can I... Can Lugapan hear me? We can connect within a mile. You're not on the same plane anymore. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Fuck. <laughs> uh, you know this place, you've been here before. Um, oh, I am. You're in the shadow fell. Okay. Hmm. Uh, you do hear a wet slick sound of damp sagging flesh move and slither across the stone behind you and then that is followed by a clicking of insect like bone feet click clacking on the stone faces Bumsies I know it's you and I will um yeah I'm, I'm just... Ooh, actually! Uh, no, 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 I'm, I'm okay, yeah. I'm just going to not look at him. <laughs> okay. You just stay focused on the door? Um, no, I just close my eyes. Okay, you can close your eyes, and as you do, you feel a hot breath just on the back of your neck. What do, and I'm going to fold my arms. Ramses, what do you want? <laughs> <laughs> breath subsides, the sounds disappear, and you're left in the darkness alone. On my own? Hmm. Um, If I tell them there, telepathically try to connect, uh, talk to him, do I hear anything? Uh, You can give me a wisdom saving throw. Sure! Oh, this, oh, uh, an unnatural, oh, wait, 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 sorry, I'm wise again, too. I'm so <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, shit! You've a plus seven to wisdom. Holy shit! The solar stats are ridiculous. Yes, uh, twenty-six. Uh, that is the DC. Uh, you're okay. You retain your sanity as you peer through the mind of God and try to contact them, and you do meet something very hollow and deep endless but there is a mind there so he's, he's just not speaking back just not speaking back uh, but you do feel I'll say there is a peeling away of a second consciousness from his home oh. uh, you can give me an insight check quite quickly okay so there's lots of math, but I gotta write down like Solar David stats. Mm-hmm. 
Maybe he's just upset oh, that, that uh, it's a really, man. Uh, by having them with you for so long at this stage, you recognize that the second consciousness that feels away is Gratz. It's Gratz? Yeah. Gratz's consciousness. Sorry, you cut out. What did you say? Uh, Gratz's consciousness uh, peels away from oh! and moves elsewhere. Uh, back at the ship, uh, <laughs> David has disappeared. The door still remains closed. The knocker just kind of very slowly drifts back into position, not making any sounds as it touches the door. Um, I need everyone to make me a perception check. Perception check. Oh boy. Not very good at those. I'm hella good. I got 30. <laughs> I got two. <laughs> Amazing. Uh, you don't notice anything, Mira, but in this case, it's a good thing. Uh, Tema, you see reflected in kind of. Just barely. It's, it's, it's like a muddled reflection in the porcelain, porcelain uh, walls of the ship. You see your face, face reflected back at you, but it's smoother. It's missing the uh, burnt away flesh, and you have two arms. Uh, I need to make me a wisdom saving throw. Oh, gosh. Imagine not noticing that you have two arms. <laughs> <laughs> I, I got a plus in. I got a 28. 28 is pretty good. Uh, you look at yourself. Uh, you're pretty good with two arms, but nothing seems to go any deeper than that. Reflection. This, this reflection is just in the door? It's in the walls of the ship. The, the walls of the ship are like... Um, oh. Oh, yeah, right. Porcelain. Uh, oh, so it's just what I see. What I, I just, I'm just seeing my... my re re Reflection in general. Yeah, yeah. It's just something the, different. The porcelain walls of the ship. It's kind of like, uh, it's like, it's a, like enamel a, walls. It's kind of like a, a sheen to it. Um, but your reflection definitely has two arms and isn't missing any of the uh, nasty flesh. Nasty melted. How does my how does my hair look? Uh, long oh, and luscious. Yeah. Okay. Um. Actually, I would say because you got such high perception, you have your eye. Uh, oh yeah, my eye as well. Yeah, that, that reflection isn't you. Your reflection's been stolen and taken over by someone else. You can see it through Gratz. Oh, I can. I can see Gratz through the reflection. He is your reflection. Okay. You don't have. And if I. If I if I if I move, does the reflection match my movements? Sometimes. Yeah. Okay, it's a little bit. It's t it's a little bit off then. A little bit off, and it seems to be intentionally okay. off, so that you know it's there. Oh, it looks like this isn't this isn't Ramsey's. It's well, it's it's, oh. it's it's Grat. Grat. Um, Gratz is great. I'm not do you great. remember? Do you remember? Oh, uh, we, f the, the guy who pretended to be Lucy at the time, the time machine thing. Yeah, I remember. It's just why uh, I'm here. I don't know. But oh, if it's not Ramsey's, I'm not so wary about this door. Let's go see where David went. No oh, fuck. <laughs> Um, I'll I'll go over and I'll 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 use the knocker as well like David did. Okay. Just for flavor, as she's like touching the knocker, can I cast sending and be like, "Hey, it's Ramses. Also, Gratz is here. Um, it's really dark. Be careful. Don't ring the." And then, <laughs> <laughs> it's is sending inter inter. It is. There's a five percent chance that it fails, but I already rolled to see if it failed or not. Oh. Because I have unlimited sending to Mira because of my tattoo. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You can relay that time. I mean, I hear it just before I go for the knocker, so I'm like, wait. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
Mr. David, are you still going for the knocker? Me? me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, w I went for it. You go for it, you pull open the door, and it's a black void on the other side. Oh, so I can just open the door? Yep. Very, very far away at the stage, uh, you can see the faintest glow of gold, uh, which you would recognize as David. He's been getting slowly further and further away from the doors. His eyes have been closed. Um, but you do see him about 100 feet away. David! Oh, you came through! And I'll fly on over to her. Okay. Why, why are you flying away? Why are you floating away in the first place? Um, Ramsey's here. He's got a hideous form. Um... It, it it does things to your mind. Be careful. I know that you're a mind wizard, but we have to be careful. This is his domain. We're in the Shadow Fell. Shadow Fell? What the fuck? What, what does he want? Plane of. What? What does he want? Oh, did you walk through as well? You're both here. No, I mean, I think Fatima just opened the door and we can. Like, can we just see David there? Yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm just standing in the door. Yeah, door right it, it, when I use it, it just acts like a normal door. Um, I felt Gratz's presence as well as Ramsey's. I don't know. I guess they might be working together, so that's bad. Um, he's apparently here. He's on the ship? Side. Yeah. Uh, I'll try and bolt right back through the door and go to Ribena. Oh, shit. Uh, you come right through the door, uh, you dart up out of the room. Uh, first thing you notice is Luke Pan is, has turned to stone. Uh, Luke Pan! You him to the next room uh, where the doors are open. Everyone else has been turned to stone. You run upstairs to, uh, to your daughter, Vina. Uh, both her and Malakrit have already turned to stone. And she holds in her hand, uh, about to drink a uh, flagon of, of beer. Wait, what? Are, are we? Are is it, me, Mira, and Titus are all not stone? Yeah. Um. Grass. What about, what about Gideon? Uh, where is Gideon? Yeah, he's not there for some reason. He's not there. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking just left. <laughs> and to and Tony's missing as well. No, and Tony's Cine? Downstairs. Tony's oh, he's there. Oh, he's oh, he's, oh, I thought that was the. Can Air be turned to stone? It's true. It's true. City. Love our little space. Oh group. yeah, Cine. Um, I'm actually going to for him. Actually, no, he's going to be stone. Uh, but how would that even work? <laughs> air to stone. Uh, or the, the, the air, the air that he's made of could be turned to stone, I guess. Well, that's what I was thinking. Like the air particles. Uh, so there is like a pile. there's a pile of stone clothing, and then around that is tiny, like hundreds and thousands of tiny little beads of stone. Huh. Big pile. So he's like he's like a pile of gravel. Yeah, it's a pile he of turned sand to... essentially. Sydney has turned to gravel. I'll boo. Oh, I'll use um. I'll use uh. With, uh what's it called? Not prestidigitation. The other one. Uh. Blah, 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 Minor oh. illusion. Just cleaning him up. No. Thaumaturgy. <laughs> uh, yeah. So I'm going to boom my voice loud as I can. Grats. I can undo this, but I'm not happy. Where are you? You want your soul back, do you? Oh yeah, you have like part of his soul, don't you? I think I have three parts of him. <laughs> uh, you hear Maybe. just to the left of you, HA! I have no need for that anymore in the same voice that you just spoke. Oh, I have true sight. Does that help at all? Yeah, you can see to the left do of you. Have, your do, you have true, do you have true hearing? I, I mean, I have hearing. <laughs> <laughs> I have hearing. <laughs> true hearing. <laughs> I'm parallel. Oh yeah, you have true sight as a solar. Yeah. yeah. Uh, you can hear him and see him right beside you in your reflection on the ship. Uh, there's just a panel of metal. I'll say on the cannon uh, of the ship you can... Uh, 
you can probably just see him right there reflected in the can, looking at you with his hands on his hips. Uh, but it's you looking back at you. Um, I would like you to make a um, wisdom saving throw. Sorry, Matt. Is, is Lugapan still floating, or did the stone Lugapan fall to the ground? They're kind of just like perfectly, ground? they're kind of like spiral, like a little spiral body on the bottom and then coming away from that is all made of stone. Oh. Uh, it was 21. 21 is a fail. Can you roll me a d100? Yes, indeed. Oh, permanent damage! <laughs> <laughs> Eighty-two. Eighty-two. Oh, that's a bad one. <laughs> oh, I've res I have resistance to magical effects. I don't know if that counts for grass. Uh, this is a. It would actually be. A, it's a madness. It's a type of madness. Oh, okay. Trying to inflict on you. Um, so I don't think it's magical. Uh, I'm going to text to you uh, the Here we go. that you have. In, in this last five minutes, this time I'll kill everyone. <laughs> you don't You don't have re resistance to magic. You just had an advantage on saving trolls against spell. Oh, spell that's right. Well, yeah. Uh... Oh, your proficiency bonus is plus seven. My proficiency bonus is always plus seven. Oh, how do you have plus seven? Is that a hard thing? No, it was from when we were in the other world. Oh, you got an extra from the classless leveling or something? Yeah. Yes, indeed. There you go. That is your <laughs> current madness. <laughs> Is he going to try kill us again? I don't know. It's up to him. Um, I'm going to... Now? Remove that armor. There's no need for it. I'm just going to turn it into a sexy thong. <laughs> <laughs> I approve. And he's, your reflection is kind of moving back at you. You're not moving, but it's kind of almost looks like he's checking himself out in his reflection, as if you were the reflection. He's kind of moving around, looking at himself. Oh, interesting. Okay, I'm just going to... I'm going to sit cross-legged for a second while I figure out what I'm going to do about making the um, bomb. I'll, I'll, turn to, I'll turn to Mira and just be like, um, what are they? What is he talking about up there? Should we go up there? I have no idea. I guess? I don't... I don't... I can hear him yelling at somebody. Yeah, I'll, 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 I'll go... Yeah. I'll go upstairs and see what oh. David's doing. To I'll find him, you. to find him wearing a a, a cyber suit thong. <laughs> Do you find grabs? Oh, so I'm trying to think. David, what are you doing? Uh, Thinking sexy thoughts. What? You what? Oh yeah, we left the door open! <laughs> oh god damn it. I didn't think he could do that. Has he got has he got the lenses and the eyes? Oh man. Can I, oh, I can didn't I say any of that on the stream. I, fuck, I was muted the whole time. Apologies on the stream. For the very first time, uh, Ramses leaves the shadow of uh, What no one else sees. As oh, have you been muted this whole time? No, just for a very brief moment there. But yeah, oh. you made your way up. Uh, Ramses made his way up. Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll, can I go over and just like give David a shake? Yep. To try snap him out of it? Yep. How's David Stop! Right? Take off some clothes and leave me alone. What? I'm thinking... What the fuck shit. are you doing? Oh shit, wasn't Gratz the 
uh, isn't he like a sex pest or something? Oh, and then I and then I open my eyes. And I look at both of them and I cast Charm Person. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, wisdom uh, saves. Oh no, Christmas saves, isn't it? Uh, wisdom saves. Wisdom saves. Oh, thank God it's wisdom. <laughs> I thought you were <laughs> wisdom. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I'm proficient. Oh, God. oh okay. <laughs> Natural one. Natural one. Doesn't matter. Uh, Never mind. And uh, Fatima. Oh, wait, it is a magical effect, because it's Charm yeah. Person, right? I'm just uh, double-checking that I don't have anything that prevents me from being charmed or anything. Just anything that's, like, mind-related. I don't think so. Uh... No, okay. Uh, wisdom save. I got a uh, twenty-three. That fails. And uh, what did Mary get? Fourteen. That fails. What happens? You two go take a shower and take off your clothes while you're at it. <laughs> I usually, I mean, I usually do that when I shower anyway, so. So if we're charmed, we just do whatever David says, or? <laughs> just do it, mind, mind control is really dark and creepy. Is there a shower on this boat? Of course there's a shower. Yeah. Surely, there's like beds and stuff. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I guess we'll go shower naked together, which isn't like. A sexy shower. It's not the worst punishment in the world. Oh, it's only the beginning. I need to think. <laughs> I'll make another sexy thing I swear. <laughs> uh, see your reflection as they head off. Uh, Dahi just is now sitting there, kind of cross-legged, finger on their lips, like, mm, yes, good start. Oh, and then I say, by the way, um, and I wait until they both turn towards me. Mm. And I'm going to cast. Yes. Cool. Nice. What is the uh, what is the command? The command is uh, directed at Mira. Oh man. And it is cut everyone to ribbons so they're nice and wet. Oh. Cut oh, everyone to ribbons. Yeah, I want you. I want you to make everyone bleed. Oh, I assume I have to do that. I don't want any friction, and it's only if you. Oh well, this it's another saving throw. It's a wisdom saving. Throw. Another wisdom saving. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, Jesus, hmm. So dark. Uh, wait. What is my wisdom? That is a twenty-four. Fail. Damn it. Okay. Jesus Christ. Okay. <laughs> um, I start cutting people to rip it. <laughs> uh, I'll so do it also as well. So, <laughs> give <that>? me up. <laughs> 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 Sorry, what? Uh, so you're, yeah, you're, are you, everyone's stone except for you four currently that you can see. We four. Oh, wait. Oh yeah, so it's just us she's gonna cut to ribbons. Uh, yeah. Yeah, so That's... who are you attacking Mira? Uh, I suppose Potema, because she's right there. And I don't know if this ex like, extends to David. Like, if I have to. Like, if David. Oh, yeah. I'm him, walking up like he's, He said cut everyone. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, but Potema's there, so I'll I'll do that. <laughs> um, Potema's no longer charmed after she's hurt, though, I think. Just. I don't have to do a constitution save or something. No, it's, it's just, just it just it just breaks it. Yeah, that's fair. Um, well, I'll start a blade song bonus action because uh, of course I do. And you did say cut specifically, so I feel like to me that registers that use your weapons. So I will do uh, action extra attack uh, with my dreamer blades. 
Oh no, they I they were a gift. <laughs> From you. Oh. Anyway, uh so that is a twenty-one to hit and a wow, oh, roll really bad. Uh twenty-three to hit. Uh they both hit. Oh, okay. I got plus nineteen to hit there, so that you know. Uh, yeah, shit. well, break does, does 3d12 damage, so wait, uh, it was d- 21 force damage, okay, and then, uh, warp does, let's see, Seventeen plus five, so twenty-two force damage. Okay, so what was the total? Sorry. Uh, wait. <laughs> <I'm already laughs> twenty-two force damage, and what was the first bit? Uh, so something like seventeen, I think. 17. Okay. Was it more than that? I don't know. We say forty. Forty force damage. Yeah. Okay. Just start shredding, I guess. Yeah, so you just spin around, spin around slice a uh, table, table all over till every part of her body starts bleeding. Uh, and as she stands there now, dripping with blood, uh, you see a little smoke come across the reflection of Dahi's. It, it comes across the face of Dahi's reflection. And uh, he says, Well, I think we'll leave it there. <laughs> and you regain control of your reflection. The pebbles, the gravel pile starts to slowly turn back into mist and starts evaporating into the air to reform Sinew. Uh, you, uh, Malachath's face starts to crack and break and stone crumbles away. Uh, as is the same with Rodina. Um Oh, I, I snap my fingers and immediately end the gears. <laughs> Oh, okay. Oh my god. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh. Mm. Shit. Okay? Uh, what? Wait, why did it end? Um. Why did I it end? My head. Uh, rats. He told me to do bad. He... Oh. Yes, yes, oh. he did. David, why did it end? Why did he leave it there? He just said that he was going to leave it there. I think it was a test. Uh, I'm going to, like, run... Ra- oh, run. no, 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 no. It was a distraction. Shit, go downstairs. And, yeah, go downstairs. Tink! We're going to run back downstairs. We all run downstairs. Uh, you can see everyone's starting to become unpetrified. You make your way down. Uh, the door is open still. Uh, doesn't seem to be any signs of anyone else. Like Ram- kick the door closed? Hmm? No, the door is open. Can I can I kick it oh, closed? Oh yeah, you can kick it closed. Yeah, you can kick it closed. Fuck. Um, um, I think Ramsey's escaped. Where'd he go? Why? Can I go through the door again? Uh, yeah, you open it up, and it's just a blank porcelain wall with your own reflection looking back at you. Um, you said that there was a floor, right? There's nothing. There's no, nothing behind. There. No, there's no. There's nothing there, David. You open there's the door floor. and it's a porcelain. It's wall. just. It's just the wall of the ship. Yeah. Oh fuck! 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 I'm going to take um, a bit of the door, and I want to see if I can. I. I don't know how or who I'm going to ask, but I need to analyze the door and see if it's from the shadow fill, because I might need it later. Hmm. Is everyone not stone anymore? Yeah, everyone's yeah. starting to become one stone again. Where the fuck is Ramses? Um, is there any? Th- oh, oh, actually, oh, give me a second. Oh, I need, I need, I need to. Where is that? Just one sec. Um. Okay, I start to pull out some of the components, and then I cast Legend Lore. Oh. Oh, legend lore. Mm. <laughs> what, what, what does what does that do? 
it takes 10 minutes so i'm going to sit down and start mumbling to myself with my eyes closed okay. and you can see like the movement of them like across my eyelid and um, as i speak more and more rapidly and i'm trying to essentially divine lore about ramses i want to know what it means for him to escape and what happened the last time i suppose if if uh, if that takes him like 10 minutes can i like investigate around the ship and try and find yeah. like ramses or find something weird or uh, yeah, you can give me an investigation check. I'm not very good at those, but... You can try. make it with advantage, because you have true sight. Oh, good. Then I got a 12. 12. <laughs> uh, look around. If you look around for like 5-10 minutes, you can't see, you can't see anything around the ship. I assume I can't cast Loki Creature. Have I technically seen Ramses? I've seen the, the tentacle part, but is that enough for me to cast Locate Creature? I'm just wondering if it... I guess he casts his creature. Let me just double check. What is he? It says a creature that is familiar to you. I don't think you're very... In the sense that you've seen it before. Uh, okay. I should have forgot if it come in. As long as you have seen a cre that creature up close within 40 feet, 30 feet. But it can also be like a type of creature. It says so here, if I was like Ramsey, what I could do. It does say if you if you have seen the creature close up. Yeah, that's what feet, At least once. You've only seen basically like his toe. Yeah, yeah that's what I was asking you. If yeah. that's so she's, she's using detect Ramsey's toes. Yeah, but unfortunately, you haven't seen it. Oh, no. um, so, unfortunately, this wouldn't work here in, this, in regards to. Can I? Is. Because this does say that, you know, you can also look at a creature, like the nearest creature of that specific kind. So, if I say God, it'll locate the nearest God. So, you. <laughs> <laughs> no, but. <laughs> <laughs> Any gods within a thousand feet. A D twenty. Uh, okay. This is just a luck roll. Okay. Nineteen. Nineteen. Uh, the nearest god uh, <laughs> is you, but also your reflection. Hmm. <laughs> Oh, right, because Gra I thought Grat's pissed off. I'm going to go investigate my reflection. Maybe <sighs> maybe he like wants to like tag along like a little parasite. Maybe he thinks that we think he's left. And he's like, oh, they're not going to. I think he knows. <laughs> yeah, you can give me, a, give me an investigation check. Oh, yeah, I will. Bitch. <laughs> Ooh. That's a 31. Uh, 31, yeah, it's not your reflection. You can see it in the eyes. It's not you. Um, oh, the fucking bitch is still there. David, can you cage him or something? I'm, like, in the middle of the ritual. I'm, I'm like, trying to ignore. <laughs> not ignore, but you know what I mean. I'm, like, trying to focus oh, on this. <laughs> do I have anything I can cage him with? Does, he, does the reflection, like, seem alarmed by being found out, or is it just, like vibing it's just staring at you as you stare at it Same can i have. can i use hammer of, in of inquisition on the, sh the reflection will it work if i uh, yeah. so what is uh, that a saving throw that they have to make it's an intelligent saving throw okay uh nothing seems to happen no oh wait just sure yeah nothing seems to happen Still uses my side points though. What else can I do? I don't think any of my spells are useful here. So, David, uh, mm -hmm. you start to discover all of the lore that revolves around Ramses. Uh, ever since 
the gods existed when they were first titans. Uh, he was always hated. No one wanted to be a part of him. He ruined everything he touched. Uh, no one loved him. No one cared about him. And they cared about no one else. However, uh, when the titans finally wanted to steal the eyes of the dreamer, they needed him because he knew everything about the dreamer. Uh, Ramses was one of the first nightmares that the dreamer had. And he would always haunt him. Um, and so he knew a lot about him because he was so intimate with the, the dreamer. So they needed him as a weapon to best the dreamer, to scare the dreamer. Um, and when they took the eyes, Ramses used that moment to steal other parts of him because he knew that they were going to get rid of the eyes. And he thought this was a great opportunity to take parts of him, like his toenails and his skin and his bones, um, which he did. Um, and their promise to Ramses when they went to make the sanctuary away from the dreamer is that they would give him uh, his own part of Gostar, his own uh, whole chunk, his whole domain, his own domain. Uh, but they tricked him when they made Gostar and they made a uh, basically a duplicate of Gostar, a mirrored image of it, his, its own domain. Um, basically it was the same Gostar but lacking in a lot of things and they said okay you can have that part which is far away from all of our lovely Gostar over here. We're going to put you in that corner and they left him in that world, that reflection of Gostar, and he destroyed everything. He turned it into that dark, desolate place uh, that you visited a few times. That used to look like Gostar, uh, but now it is nothing but darkness and stone faces. Um, and you realize that that pocket dimension was the moon. Uh, he was put onto the moon, and the moon is the reflection of Gostar. Oh, that's why Gideon wants us to go into the moon. Uh, but it became more than that as well. It became his realm. Um, and he existed there for a long time. He was never allowed to step into Gostar. He was only allowed to look at it through a window, uh, which is the shack that he has. He's never allowed to step into it, but the shack itself um is still technically in the shadow film it's like this space between the spaces um which would allow him to trade and barter with people um and you learn that this being uh, what makes him so terrifying is the fact that he cares about nothing he just doesn't care about anything anymore he hates everything not he doesn't even hate things he just doesn't care about anything and all the followers of him have lost so much that they also cease to care anymore. The person that you saw, who saw, said um, Macarena, they were <laughs> someone who had lost everything and didn't care and wanted everything to end. And that has been his goal ever since he's been kind of betrayed and tricked, is to just yeah, get rid of everything. Macarena, man. Yeah. And so he collected the eyes. That was his plan all along. He took aspects of you, took aspects of lenses from everyone so he could build the eleventh eye of the dreamer while collecting um, all of the other eyes so that the world could end. And somehow now he's been given the ability to cross between realms. He's no longer... He was told he was never able to walk uh, in Gostar. Uh, but now Gostar's gone, he can walk wherever he pleases. He's no longer bound to the realm that he was in before. Uh, he can move anywhere he pleases, it seems. Or has found some way to do so. Uh, okay. Um, he seems He's to possess uh, one of the aspects of the, the dreamer as well. He owns the uh, fear eye. Okay, fear aspect. Got it. The fear aspect. Okay, so I take a like... <laughs> And I open my eyes, and he's through. He he has free reign. He was on the moon, it turns out. And I just start, like, yammering and just explaining everything that you said. And then I start, like, tricking the components for yet another spell. And then I try... Can I see the reflection of Grass? Uh, you see your reflection. You can give me... Oh, you've got True Sight. Uh, yeah, I'd say you can see that he's in your reflection. He's in my reflection. Okay. 
Um, I am going to. I know what is he is is Grats? He's technically the god of lust, right? Yeah, he's the god. Yeah, he yeah god. He's the opposite of love, essentially. He's everything. Um, all I... the bad aspects of. Okay. Um, I can make him go away. Maybe. You guys should. I, I should probably make him go away, right? Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Has David, uh, David, has, David has David kept his suit as a as a thong? Oh, I'm I'm i I've I forgot to put it back while I was casting the ritual, and then I just kind of <laughs> uh, uh, and then I put it back the way that it. Oh, okay. <laughs> um. Oh, she's done it. God. Um. Wait, what's going on? Oh, sorry. Oh, Rose got it. Blue, uh, yeah, she's got it. Um, Blue has done a poo. I mean, she's been very good. We've been on the the call for a very long time. So. Oh, that that is fair. Yeah, we've taken her out a few times. But anyway, what what is your plan? Do I think the plane shift would work on it if I can hit the reflection? If not, I have another thing, but it yeah, takes me, longer. I think Ethan, you're smart enough to know that uh, he's tactically put himself in reflections. You think it might just bounce back at you? Oh, okay. And I will explain that then. Um, whatever we did to him will come back at us. Um, yeah, I tried to. I tried to blast his mind, but the reflection isn't. I don't know where his actual self is. And I will explain that I do have one other idea, and I will just for one minute start doing uh, what it takes to summon my magnificent mansion. Mm. And I will bar the entry of one Gratz and put everyone else in it. So everyone that I know on the ship is allowed entry, not Gratz. Okay. I don't know if it'll work, but at least we have a nice place to go. <laughs> um, I'm sort of a little bit. <laughs> this is so stressful. <laughs> okay. You uh you open the door, everyone's kinda of already flooding in. Gabriel's kinda of coming in, it's like, oh, what is going on? What's the plan? Uh are we all just we heading now to the next location? Uh, it's I, I don't know what it is, I assume we're heading to uh like what's beyond the ethereal realm. Is it like uh do we go to what? What? I don't know. Uh, no. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna go into David's little, you know, his little magical house. Uh, 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 Our big magical house. Uh, yeah, we're gonna go in there because there's a there's something on the ship. Okay. Okay. Um. Right. Do you remember Gables? Do you remember seeing the movie Alien? I do. Yes. It's like Alien, except it doesn't want to kill us. It wants to fuck us, and it wants us to fuck each other. Oh, that's brilliant. It's the god of lust. Oh, um, I could do with some of that. Yes. I mean, it's a different <laughs> Oh, it's been so long. Fucking seven. Gabriel, years. get on the yeah. get on get right. in the match. Yeah. Okay, six years. Okay, I'm going in. I'm going in. No worries. <laughs> you yeah. fucking shadow. Okay, just close the door. Okay, okay. Well, you got it, boss. <laughs> close the door. Uh, you're gonna start bringing everyone into the mansion. Is that the plan? Yeah, and I'm going to hope. From what I understand of it, that he shouldn't be able to come in because it's not his domain; it's my domain. <laughs> Got it. Uh, so start bringing everyone uh, into the mansion. Got marked it. Lock. One sec. And and Tony. Tony, of course. Oh, no, I forget about Tony again. Tony's so not here. Find... He's going to be here for the end of the the God of the World. <laughs> <laughs> Is Gideon actually not here? Uh, I don't know where I put him, but I think he should be here. Oh, okay. Oh, so he's like technically here. Yeah. yeah so he, he hasn't left the ship. No, no, he's. Oh, okay. He's just my bad. He's just, he's just, he's just brooding. Yeah. Oh, fuck. It's dragging him anyway. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, come. Do the 
I mean, just like, okay, it's fine. We'll just say you're in the, you start making your way into the mansion. Uh, one at a time, you count everyone, uh, close the door, and you can breathe. And then inside this mansion, there is a lineup of people in uh, different uh, kind of tuxes, uh, black and white tuxes with dicky bows, uh, all there and all bow uh, at the same time in sequence with each other. And as they sit up, uh, you can stand up straight, you can see all of their faces uh, reflect each one of the members of the ship. There's an old Gabriel, but he's young. There's a Gideon, but he's kind of a bit tidier. And there's a, there's a young old Gabriel. There's a young <laughs> old Gabriel. <laughs> there is a humanoid dragonborn uh, with a purple head, very similar to Nukapan. There is um, oh, wow. Tony. There are uh, two uh, fur bulbs. Uh, of... No Tony. I don't remember Tony. Oh, you don't remember Tony. That's fair enough. Uh, <laughs> but there are there's a there's a uh, a what's the word? A butler or a maid for everyone. Uh, a RuneScape butler. A RuneScape butler and maid for everyone in the audience. Was the first MMO I ever played, so that makes sense. <laughs> uh, it was really funny when you used their tokens in PB or Valium. <laughs> Cass couldn't get over it. <laughs> I didn't know Cass flew. Um, oh my god, it is actually right there. That makes sense. <laughs> um, so as soon as we get in, I just rush to like the nearest mirrored surface. Do I see him? No. He's not here? Doesn't seem to be. Fantastic. Um, guys, we have... It's not that we can be here that long, but we have 24 hours. He can't come in here. We can come up with a plan to get rid of him. I don't know what he's going to do to our lovely ship. Oh! Oh! Can he, can he stay on the ship as a reflection if there's We're no actually, one there? One second, I just need to read something really... Ah, oh, shit. Okay, wait, 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 wait. I need to try and do this. Um, how big is our ship? Uh, what do you mean? Like, how wide and tall would you say? Okay. <laughs> um, actually, I have it here. Uh, what is it, like, 30 spell. feet? I've got it in the spell, Jimmy. Like, no, 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 it's much bigger than that. Um, oh, doesn't matter. It's okay, it's okay. I don't think I can do anything about it. Okay. What is the? Uh, I was, I was gonna try because the, the ship is sentient. I was gonna try and bring the ship into the mansion. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, he's it's... on the ship. Yeah, I know he's on. Well, the, you could on... bring. Oh, you could bring the ship, but not Grat. Yeah, exactly. And then just like, hopefully, you get bored and leave. <laughs> if you play, if you plane shift the ship, can you take us with it? Or, um, technically, but I can only take. I think it's ten creatures with plane shift. Oh, right. I could help you with that if you wanted. Oh, that's also fair. Oh, do you know, I, I keep every, like, in the gaps of time between us playing, I always think, oh, yeah, me and me and Mira should definitely, like, collaborate on a, on a cast. <laughs> we should have collab, but we never do. <laughs> we were yeah, offered that... that opportunity, we never did. <laughs> there, there'd be enough between two of you, then. You could plane shift us all and leave yeah. Grat. Yeah, that makes sense. And potentially Ramses, wherever Ramses is. Maybe he's not here. He just needed a, a way into wherever we are. We're on the ethereal plane? Yeah, what other, what plane would we shift to is the issue. Because the material plane seems to be fucking gone. Yes, that is true. But the, I suppose the space, the dark. I did take some of Ramsey's doors so he could go to the Shadowfell. Can you, uh, go, can you go to any plane? With plane I shift. I have to have um, something attuned to it. So like a metal rod. That kind of way. Um, but, but, but I could create one potentially. It would take time, but either way. Is the dreamer on this realm or another realm? Well, David, give me an intelligence check. Sure. Uh, Mira can also make an intelligence check. I mean, we could go to the demon realm. I have something. Oh, oh no! I have, I have, Not I have... the demon. The, the demon realm's gone. Is it gone? I have like a like a little like a light like eyes light. About. I, I think it's gone. I don't think oh. it's there anymore. The demons have left the demon plane. But the but the realm itself is also gone. How did that happen? I mean, they left. So I assume it's gone or disappearing. Mira, or maybe. Wait, but is if it's empty, then 
No, but I assume they wouldn't have left if they had we, time to we stay. Also don't know. Mm. Did, when they're saying this, do I know, like, from studying in the tower, do I know, like, it's positioning as a celestial, like, thing? Uh, or, like, do I know it's positioning as a plane outside of Gostar? So, like, are we, like, further away? You're further away from the demon realm, yeah. So, Wait! So the demon realm will be closer to Gostar? Yeah, so Wait, there, can... there's, like, the material realm of Gostar, there's the demon realm, then there's the elemental planes, and then there's the ethereal realm, which you are right in, oh. in which you're in okay. right now. What are you going to say, Tim? We could go back to our world. We could. Oh, we actually what the fuck is your world? That I, that I do have the, the stuff for. I have I have a, an object from that world. I do too. It's. <laughs> oh, I mean... It was the sacrificial tower which people jumped off of. I have I have that. What sacrificial <laughs> tower? The Eiffel Tower. <laughs> what? Oh. <laughs> yeah, I have I have that role. I have. Why would, have... would we go there though? Does, I assume it's also. Not... We just need to go anywhere. We need to not be here. Oh, but actually, and then come back. G Gabriel, I'm, I was in the shadow felt yeah. when you described it. Mm -hmm. Did Gratz separate himself from Ramses? Was he attached to him somehow? Yeah, he seemed to be like a passenger on board within Ramses' being. Amazing. Okay, Mira, can you cast the tech thoughts? Do you have access to that? Uh, I think so. Might do. Okay, I'm going to please cast it and cast it on me while I do something. Okay. I'm going to uh, reach for one of the soul cages that has one of the parts of um, Gratz. And I'm going to... Wait, I just got to read the description so I can say it right. I'm going to use Eyes of the Dead. And I'm going to name a place that it saw. And I'm going to see... I'm going to see what Gratz would have seen from the perspective of Ramses. I want to see where Ramses is. So I can use an action to name the place that, yeah. say, Grat saw, and yeah. create an invisible sensor in that place. Mm. Uh, so a place he saw. Okay, yeah, so a place Gratz has seen. Uh, yeah, I can concentrate on it for up to 10 minutes, as if it would, yeah. So you want to put a thing, a sensor that can see something where Gratz has been, uh, hoping that Ramses is there? No, no, because he was on Ramses, right? Yeah, I'm yeah. taking Ramses. Oh, you're putting him in, putting it in Ramses. Yeah, I want to make a sensor. Yeah, yeah, that's that. cool. That's cool. I like that. If that's possible, you got okay. It. And then you want me to detect your thoughts too? Yeah, so you can see it as well. Okay. Yeah. What the fuck is happening? <laughs> <laughs> this is great. This is so cool. Uh, so you're using Eyes of the Dead, so you can go back to the place where. You... Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, yeah. And that just happens. Um, yeah, there's no save. He he can probably see it if he tried to, I guess. Mm. Because he probably has true sight himself, being a god and all, but it's an invisible sensor, is what it says. Yeah. Uh, they're gonna let you see what they see right now, and the pair of you both see static of a TV. Uh, not just the static alone, but the TV as well itself. In the dark room, there's a TV that they're looking at, and there's static on it. They're in some sort of room, staring at the static of a TV. Oh my god. But they don't get out much. Uh, we know they're in a room somewhere. Uh, give me a perception check. See if you can catch anything in the corners of their eyes. Sure. I just read an additional part of the description in case it's important. Uh, a creature that can see the sensor, such as one using invisibility, or see invisible or true sight, sees a translucent image of the tormented humanoid whose soul you caged. So he just sees, like, a tormented aspect of Gratz. So, I don't know if he necessarily knows what that means, but maybe wow. he just sees Gratz. So, okay, okay, cool, cool. No, but it's Gratz, so I don't give a shit. You can fuck Perfect. off. Got it. <laughs> oh, natural 20. Natural 20. Uh, David, you know where he is because you have made your mansion. And you know all the rooms in your mansion. He's in the PlayStation room. He's in the PlayStation. And I just say that out loud. He's in the PlayStation room. <laughs> Wait, Wait he's he's in the the how, how did he get in the mansion? mansion? He's in the fucking mansion. He's in uh, my room. Wrote down oh, here, you said you, you want to exclude Gratz, Gratz, but everyone else you know can go into your mansion. But every friendly thing that was... As in, you said friendly. friendly. 
Oh, I meant to say all Okay, the well, while while he's in your mansion, let's plane shift us to a different plane. The ship and all of us, and we can leave Gratz and Ramses here. Can okay. we get it out of mansion, though? So we can plane shift 16 beings between us. I think we've got enough. I think we can do that. Oh, it's only six. It's only eight each? Uh, what were yeah. the intelligence yeah. checks that Mira and David got? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. Sorry, so... 18. I think there's 14 of us. Oh, and the ship, 15. Sorry, one check. 25? Uh, so, you need to... Oh, sorry. Seven. You, you can plane shift anywhere that you have an item attuned to, that place, right? Yeah. From, yeah. Uh, y if you spend an hour to attune to one of the aspects of the Dreamer, you can plane shift directly to him. To the Dreamer? That doesn't sound like a good idea. Is that could what we're we Could we plane shift to one of the other aspects? Gideon, where that. are we going? Could do that if you want. Oh, I like that. Yeah, why don't we plane? Sh why don't we use one of the aspects to plane shift to another aspect, and we can kill that as well. One thing to keep in mind though: two of those two aspects uh, belong to Gratz and. Uh, Fuck, uh, Gratz has an aspect. I, I guess we can't. We can't choose what aspect. It'll be random. Yeah, because you don't know where they are necessarily. Yeah, it's a bit of a gamble. Do we want them all, though? Do you know what? Is there a, a reason we want to collect them? I don't know if we want to have them, but we want to kill the things that are them, I presume. Hmm. Yes. That's fair. I'm going to send some of the servants to go and play with Ramsey's on the PlayStation. And just see what happens on the sensor while I'm doing <laughs> <laughs> This is like a weird Wait. Friday night, like... I don't actually know the game. The, the, is it Friday, Friday Night at Freddy's or whatever? Oh, it yeah. feels like that right now, where you're just sending people. I don't know if that's. It's kind. Of, I don't know if that's the same thing. But you're watching people see if it's, they get butchered or not intent. in the room. I'm just trying to um, see. Wait, David. We where did did you, you communicated with the mother doe before we flew away? Oh yeah. What did she say she was doing? She was trying to see if she could protect the small bit of her. She's tr she was trying to save as much as she could. So, so like, does that mean she, she was saving people and bringing them to a different realm? Yes, to their domain, to her domain. Maybe well, I could try. We could yeah. go there, yeah, because do I do have something that was given to me by the Mother Doe. Yes, a heart. <laughs> no, no, I gave her back the heart. Um, oh, okay. She gave me, she, when I, when she gave me a little figurine, a little unicorn figurine to summon Steven with. But isn't all so of that gone? Okay. Um, well, the mother doe took them. Did she take them away to her plane of existence? Doesn't she have a different yeah, yeah. place? I think she has her own domain. Yeah, yeah, all of the gods God. had their own domain within the ethereal realm. So, so we it might play. still be there. Sounds like a great idea. Let's go to the mother doe. Mother doe might be a good option, actually. Um. Yes. Because she always yes. she always unfucks everything that we fuck. That's true. She makes us virgin again. Okay. Sorry, Sorry old Gabriel. <laughs> yes, you know, I'll find my time when all this is done, and I'll find I think... a youth potion or something. Get back those years. <laughs> oh shit! I probably should have thought of doing something like. I'm sorry, buddy. You could do that. I could do research, and then we could see if I could do that. I'm pretty sure I could do something like that. Okay. I could definitely do that. I could probably try to be Tate Chun Chu younger yourself, maybe. Oh, actually, yeah. I don't know if I want to do the right now. I don't want to waste my resources when they're... Right now is not the time. I'm sorry, but... But when, when, when we're having a moment, I'll, I'll try to do that, okay? I'm having a moment right now, but that's okay. We're not sharing it. That's okay. When we're sharing it together, we can do it then. I'll remember. Okay. Cool. So, David. Um, David, there was have... something I need to talk to you about. Okay. I completely forgot about it. I don't, this might not be the time. That's understandable. Um, but. Yeah. Well, with this... all of this. Um. But when I was out. After you, you killed me. Um, 
Yeah, so, again, sorry about that. Haven't had a chance. Sorry. Yeah, no, no, sorry. it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I get it. It was a weird... It was the planet. It was, you know... <laughs> yes. While I was out... Um, and I'm not 100% sure whether it was a dream or not, but in the light of everything that's been going on, I feel like it might not have been a dream. Okay. Um, I saw the Demogorgon, you know, Lucy's um, ex fiance. Yes. Here in, in the Astral Sea. Oh my god. With all of his demons. And that was fine. You know, actually, it was quite okay. He wasn't in like a like a like a super murderous mood or anything. We had a conversation though. You had a conversation with the Demogorgon. I had a, yeah. You know, we, we fought as well, but you know, <laughs> but you know, I'm 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 pretty cool, so you know, he couldn't do anything. Uh, <laughs> but but before we make any uh, decisions on where we're going and who we're seeing. And I know you're you're a man of plans. You know, you like you like doing that. Yeah, I'm already like taking out the components and getting things ready. But <laughs> yeah, and I'm pause. I'm pausing. I'm pausing. No, you know, but, I'm mid like but, action. But have you? I sure as hell haven't. But have you thought about what happens when we get the dreamer? What do we do? When we get the dreamer. Yeah, when we get there, like to the end of the this journey we're taking, when we get there. What do we do? What happens? What happens to the dreamer or what happens with the dreamer? Either, both. Hmm. Are we planning to fight him? Is that I, the listen, plan? We uh this is the first chance, really, that um I've had any space to think. So I'm going to I'm, say, I'm really sorry, I'm really sorry, but now that you're here, I I I need, I need someone else to give me some insight because I am going insane. These are good questions. I honestly saw Gideon and then everything was so go, go, go. Since then, I was like, let's listen <laughs> to that. I don't, I don't I don't, trust Gideon to figure this out I, for us. I think he's just trying to lead us somewhere and he's expecting us to figure it out. But what do we do when we get there? Ooh. Well, personally, this is going to sound crazy, but I think you have to be a little crazy for this. Uh -huh. I think that things will just be okay. No, you don't understand. They, 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 <laughs> <laughs> like started to shake. <laughs> David, no, you don't understand. I had the conversation no, with no, the Demogorgon. No, he is on his way. He wants to kill the Dreamer and he wants to take his place. I don't want it. We shouldn't. Mm. He wants to take his place as the new god of this realm. Just, just, the entire everything. Hmm. And obviously, I was like, oh, "That's stupid." You know, that, you know, it makes no sense. I think the uh, most. But then, important but you know, he said that that's what has to happen. <laughs> if he dies, if we go and take out the dreamer, Something someone like has to take his place. Mm -hmm. it, we can't leave a void behind. Am I, am I privy to this conversation? Um, yeah, you're yeah. there. I suppose. I can. I can. I can hear everything they're saying. Yeah. Okay. So what you're saying is this demon guy is now our ally. In the sense that, you know, he also wants him dead, but he wants to take his place. And to be fair, I mean, I don't know where, like, like what you would call the alignment of the Dreamer. The Demogorgon is 100% evil. Selfish, yes. 100%. He cannot be the next god, capital G. Yeah, 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 but this is perfect. This is amazing. The Demo, Demo Gogo kills the Dreamer, <laughs> and then obviously has been weakened, and we kill that motherfucker. But then who takes the place? I don't know, this little living bell that I have in my pocket? Who cares? Some Somebody. I care! If we got the, then we'll just have another dreamer who'll just want to wake up and then we'll have to do it all over again. I know, Tony? What? You trust Tony to become God? No, not Tony. <laughs> Tony is pure of heart, though. We just uh, need and I don't, but who is Tony anyway? Yeah. Tony's just some guy. I'm just some guy. I'm an exactly. No, but that's the thing. I don't think Tony. Uh, no offense, Tony, but I don't think Tony has what it takes yeah. to become a god. <laughs> I've I've I don't know if you know, but I've taken on a T Rex. No, I've also taken on a T Rex. Like, I'm there's, gonna, like, I'm like, there's like, three people in this room have taken on a T Rex. It's fine. <laughs> Do you, do you think you should be 
You should take on that mantle. Oh no, absolutely Mira? fucking not. That's why I'm asking David. <laughs> I've had <laughs> David idea. point. I was. I don't know. I just I've maybe had an idea. Be, yeah. What if we? So if something has to take its place, what if everything takes its place? What if every single person, or the split second of a moment, is the dreamer? Did you just, just take my fucking idea? <laughs> that I said that we should have done that with the wishing coins. That's what I said we should have done. No, and I everyone don't. was like, nah, we're going to fucking freeze the time and until some fucking guy says Macarena. And look how that worked out. That was real fucking helpful. That was my suggestion with the dreaming coins, uh, wishing coins, and you guys just shot it down. I don't know what you're talking about. But tell me. I suggested this Tama, please, ages ago. Tama, please, we're trying to make a be, plan. No, but to, be, to be fair, David, your plan does now soft, like, sound awfully a lot like what... But Tama was saying, and I don't you know, remember you didn't thing. seem very fond of it back then. Like honestly, no. But can oh, you imagine? Jesus. Every no, no, single person is God. To the point of being the dreamer. I'm, I'm saying I'm, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go above deck. I need to cool <laughs> off. There's no deck. We're on a <laughs> in the mansion. Can I can I leave the mansion to go of above course deck? You can. Uh, I can't yeah, ban yeah, you. No, no, I don't no. actually. Sorry? Yeah, yeah, you can leave the mansion, yeah. yeah. I mean, there's no need to be in the mansion. Yeah, Fucking yeah. Ramses and Gratz are playing PlayStation. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go above there. Yeah, you yeah, leave, uh, as soon as you come out, come out you're currently for no deck. Uh, as you exit, all of the ship is covered in mirrors. It's just it's all just, just, uh, silver. silver. Everything is silver. Oh, weird. Okay. You see a reflection all over. He was everything. he was busy before he started playing PlayStation. He didn't. Oh, wait, it's just. Oh, wait, it's just Ramsey's playing PlayStation. Bratz is still here, right? Bratz is still here. Fuck. 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 You see reflected in all these mirrors. Uh, your face kind of gets stretched and elongated. Uh, and takes the form of Gratz, who's just looking at you, smiling, on like a massive wall. Okay, can I like square up with him, like go right up to the reflection? Yeah, you go right up, and the, the, the head gets smaller and smaller as you make your way closer to the wall, until it's just you, and it becomes less and less distorted and more like just your own reflection now, as you're looking at yourself. Yeah, well, I know it's him. I'm just gonna lock eyes with him, and I'm gonna. I have a, I have a, a, a something on my back with just tied on with a string. Uh, I'm going to, I'm gonna without without mi breaking eye contact with Gratz, I'm gonna take take the demon arm off my back, and I'm gonna I'm gonna move it to where my my tentacle arm was. As you do, like uh... the separate part. I'm gonna I'm gonna carry like hold it hold it up to the the <laughs> metal part, the metal plate thing. Bring it up towards the metal plate, and small threads of red flesh begin to wrap themselves around the metal. Uh, they pull the metal away, and then begin to insert themselves into the stub of your flesh, and begin to meld with your own flesh until uh, blood begins to pour down the arm, and now you start to feel a pulse within the arm. Uh, you can see the veins bulging and pumping blood into this arm. You get pins and needles for a second, and then a hot flush, uh, almost like fire is inside your veins. Fire and acid uh, shoots all around your body. Your eye, for a second, goes bright yellow, uh, like that of a demon or something, like, uh, like solar and flames. You blink for a second, it goes away, and you connect with the demon. <clears throat> Nice. Now see, looking at the your reflection, it's just grass. Yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna square. I'm gonna keep just squaring up with him, just holding, maintaining eye contact. I just, I just want them to know that we're we're coming for him. Mm -hmm. He kind of just gives. Bow. And, uh, uh, can you give me a wisdom saving throw? Sure. 
That is a 29. Uh, you feel a pang of something for a second. You feel, you can see your reflection, uh, these jagged spikes of mirror uh, are starting to come out of your head. And then as you swipe at them or kind of like knock them away on your head, they're, not, they're no longer there. You were no longer under the influence of the spell that he was trying to cast over you. Oh, it was just a reflection. Yeah, it was just happening in the reflection. Oh, okay. Uh, back in the mansion, as everyone's talking, you just see uh, Titus saying, uh, Hey, 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 um, if the option's open, I could be gone. No! <laughs> What is it? What is it? No. Right? I mean, look at David. Well, I mean, no, I wait, right. And I immediately said no, of course, because I'm not a fucking idiot. <laughs> I mean, who's better than me? Right? I don't know. Yeah. Fuck. Like, I think they're pretty universally hated, right? I don't know much about you, but I'm, that's the feeling I'm getting. What if we made Gabriel God? Well, for that, I mean, I know I'm of like perfect balance between mind and body and everything, and I'm super zen. But like, I would really love to start fucking again and like, you know, get my young body. I just want to die. I want to have like a proper life. I haven't even had a proper life. I have been in a void, man. I have been in a void for like 50, 60 years. It is not fun. That's basic. I'm just looking at stars for the next fucking forever. So. <laughs> If, you know, you gotta make me god, then that's cool, that's cool. Very meta as well, having the DM be, like, the god of the world. That's kind of crazy, isn't it? But, no. <laughs> <laughs> he actually says that. No, who said that? That was, I had a, I had a bit of a slip up there. I don't know what I was saying. But, it would be cool. I mean, but no, it wouldn't be cool. Because I would fucking, that would suck. But, maybe. I think I mean, it's better. Do the plan that... I didn't know it was Batema's plan. I think that's the best one. God, she got so mad. But what if it doesn't work? I'm just like, listen, David. Oh, so you're saying we should have a fail -sick? Yes, I just I just need someone to be on the same page as me. I need someone to assure me that no matter what happens, it's going to be okay. And if, obviously, I don't want anyone to become God. It, no, it's, it's, it's I hate that idea. I, I, you're, not, you're not interested in not in the take. least fuck okay I have um. never ever ever wanted to be king or god or anything I want to roam I want to be nobody I also want to be able to be me and like go do cool shit be responsible for child that's as, that's as much as I want I love you <laughs> <laughs> Emotions are running high. Um, no, I don't want to be God. I don't think that there should be a God. But if we have to, then I think that we split God into many multiple millions and billions and trillions of pieces. And if that doesn't work, then maybe there's also the option of literally, as I said, like, I don't know if they're necessarily the same thing. Maybe effectively they're functionally the same. But essentially making it so that every single person for a split second becomes the dreamer and it just keeps going as a sequence of lights forever and ever never long enough for anyone to be able to use the power but just that it pulses through all of us just as life does do you get me <laughs> i look a little frazzled as i'm saying it. well yes but then also <laughs> i mean <laughs> but there's so many things that go wrong with that like someone might die the exact second they get the power and suddenly the god is dead and the universe ends Okay, that makes sense. <laughs> you know, there's, there's, there's so many ways. And you know, if, if people knew that they were having the powers of God, even if for a split second, do you think someone could prepare themselves for that? You know, just try to... I'm just concerned that if we leave that void open, anyone can grab it. It's up for anyone to take, including people like the Demogorgon or fucking worse, Ramses. Think of all the million, hundreds and millions of years. I'm not saying that it might not happen, but trust me from experience. Have you seen me? Look at this armor. Look at everything I've done. I have done everything, and I mean everything, to try and stop from being hurt. I still get hurt. Everyone still gets hurt. Things happen. Things will always happen. There's never 100%. 
there's point zero 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 to infinity. But that's my point. One. We are the only people, probably ever, in history or ever again, who have the power to do something about that. If we're going to kill God, that's the highest power ever. We can do if we plan this correctly. We could make sure there's nothing stopping us from making sure that nothing goes wrong. You're saying becoming God. I'm not saying becoming God, but like, there has to be... Uh, the, I don't know if I should trust the demon Gorgon's word or not, but he seemed pretty convinced that that was the only way it was going to go down. Someone is going to take that throne, and someone is going to be God. Well, there's a lot of people I don't want it to be, and not very many that I do. Mm -hmm. I, just, uh, I don't know why I'm expecting you to have an answer. I'm sure you, you don't, but I was just... I do have an idea. What if we try to reset the Dreamer and make it so that nobody knew who the Dreamer was? Not even the Dreamer. So the Dreamer lives, they have their normal life, they die, someone else becomes the Dreamer, never knows it. We just make it that nobody even knows what the dreamer is, who the dreamer is. There's no way to intuit. If we can somehow erase the memory of the dreamer and everyone's memory of the dreamer, then I think that's maybe the safest thing we have. Not even necessarily killing the dreamer, just finding a way to bring it back. You sound an awful lot like the gods of Goster. I'm, I'm just saying. Oh, I'm not trying to contain him. No, but, you know... Imagine giving the I'm dreamer... Just the chance to live a life and not even, you know, have to bear all of the weight that it does. I don't even know. I can't comprehend fully. Like I haven't fucked with the dreamer like you and Patema. Um, but if that's out of pure fear, I'm I'm not looking. I don't. I don't. I just no agency. Agency. It's all I've ever cared about. Um. Well, that's not really true, I suppose. But... I'm not saying it's the best idea, but I will say that I don't think we're going to end up having a good idea. I think no matter what we're going to do, we can pick it apart until the end of the world, which isn't that fun. Um, But... We can have plan A, plan B, plan C, and they can all be equally good or shit. But I think at the end of the day, you just got to do. You just got to do whatever it is you can do and keep going. And, and if it comes down a... to someone having to take up the mantle. I think the idea of somebody taking up the mantle and not knowing that they have the mantle may be the best idea. I and can... nobody else knowing either. I can do it. I can do it. Who said that? Who said that? I can do it. I've, I've done that. What if we promised to make it so that you had a perfectly normal life? You didn't even know that you were the dreamer. Oh, I mean, that would be kind of nice. Does that mean I forget all of you? No. Maybe? Probably not. Okay. Does that mean I think the idea is to make everyone also forget that the dreamer exists. The dreamer will still exist. But nobody idea. knows it. I mean, the gods get their power from people worshipping them, right? Yeah. What happens if no one knows about the gods? No, not a single soul can worship them. That, that'd be pretty... That gives them no power. It might be the way to do it. I don't know how to do that, but that sounds cool. I'm not sure either, but I can start trying to construct. We would need everything that we have. And no doubt more. But we do have a couple of schools of magic right beside us. Uh, as you've been talking, David, uh, all of those uh, maids and butlers uh, that have been walking around the mansion, they no longer have distinct uh, faces of every one of your party members. They all now just have very simple, plain uh, mannequin faces. Completely oh, white, made of stone, stone. That would, like hollowed out eyes and open, hollowed out mouths with black ichor pouring out of them. 
and slowly all the color has been sapped from the mansions. Energy mansion. Huh? I need to go make another mansion. <laughs> <laughs> um. Maybe we should go and find Potema. I don't. We shouldn't have let yeah. her go. Congrats on her. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, I just needed to get that out. Do you want to start um, getting ready to plane shift, and we'll try and go to the mother dough? Yeah, can do. Okay. And yeah, I'll go and try and call Potema. Okay. And you're going to okay. her? Yeah, I'm gonna okay. peek through the portal and be like, "Yoo hoo!" Uh, yeah, you you head out, and uh, the entire ship is covered in mirror. It's just all mirror, and that... everything is smooth and reflective. I close my eyes. Katama, we're plane shifting from inside. Uh, I'll say at this by this point, she's probably um, not still staring at rats, but actually just staring at the arm and. Uh, contemplating what she's done. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, not in a, oh no, what have I done thing, but like just thinking about it and yeah. how she can use this. Oh, and she also has fingers on her left hand again. It's been a while. Yeah, you move them and you're, and you're, you're there thinking uh, as much as you can. They, they, they move when you want them to move. Uh, there's a lot of strength in this arm. Uh, maybe more strength than there was in the tentacle, and there isn't this strange oh. disconnect that you had with the tentacle, where only, oh, yeah. it wasn't quite, you know, there was someone else's soul living in it, but also it was mechanical, it wasn't flesh. Uh, this is just so um, receptive to everything. You feel like you have so much control over this arm. Yeah, so I'm probably contemplating that and, and kind of just flexing the arm and the fingers a bit too much to actually be able to be really taking in anything outside of that, so I don't really hear David calling. You'll probably find her within the uh, mirror of the, the, the deck, or I don't know if you're above deck now at this stage or not. Just wherever I'm, I'm just kind of want, walking aimlessly as I'm doing this. Yeah. Uh, you'd find her eventually above deck, David. Uh, again, the deck itself is covered in uh, reflective surfaces. All the cushions on the sofas are mirrors. They're soft fabric still. Uh, everything has just become silver. Have you met Gratz? Are you you right now, Patema? Patema? Oh, Brian Shaker. Oh. I get close enough and she's still not responding. Huh? What? 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 Did, did, are you, did you decide what to do? Oh yeah, you're definitely the tamer. Um, yeah. <laughs> we're, going to, we're going to the mother dough. Okay, cool. I'll take out the little unicorn figurine and give it to David. Okay, you coming in? Yeah, yeah, let's go. Um, oh, I, I suppose we need everyone else to come out. <laughs> actually. <laughs> but we'll go to the entrance of the mansion and then start casting and then try and bring everyone to the ship. But yeah. not Bratz and not Ramsey specifically. All right, cool. Uh, so you begin to cast a spell. I will say uh, Gratz has begun to, well, he has kind of taken over most of the ship or has at least left his... Uh, reflective surfaces all over the ship so he can wander freely within its walls. So him and me too are kind of uh, within the ship at the same time. Oh, okay. So, so we can't take the ship. It's up to yourself. You can take Gratz and me too uh, with the ship if you want to take oh, the yeah, ship. That's, yeah, that's what we call the ship because you, you put your hump back that's into the, the ship. That's the only thing that's making the ship itself living right now. Is the fact that yeah. Me Too is in there, but also at the same time, Gratz is currently existing within the physical ship as well. Um, if you think of it like Me Too is a body and Gratz is like a virus within that body. No, I, I can I can visualize that. I'm just trying to figure out if I should um, 
I think we should take the ship. ship. I think we can deal with Gratz. I think more... so? Yeah, I think so. Well, we'll have the mother doll then. I'm just concerned about the fact that he, he wants to be here on this ship. Of course he does. We're here. The dreamers definitely sent him for us. Hmm. Okay. Hey, look, if we change, if we get to choose the playing field, I think um, it's going to be at a disadvantage. If you're ready to come with us, Kratz, then that's up to you. And, I mean, I guess what we both start trying, we both hold onto the unicorn figure. <laughs> Our little guy try and move our way over to a different plane of existence. I like that it's like uh, you know the fusion dance in Dragon Ball, but the unicorn's like floating <laughs> between you, and you go in to meet the unicorn at the same time. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> okay, I guess. Yeah, I think it's I think it's instantaneous. Yeah. All right, let's, ritual. let's play and shift us all to the mother doll. You come together, <laughs> and in an instant, the ship <laughs> lands in an endless forest in every direction. Immediately, the mother, show, mother doll appears on the ship uh, in her kind of smaller humanoid form, brings down her hood, showing her silvery eyes, and there's this expression of complete betrayal on her face. Oh. And she just says, why have you done that? And all the trees <sighs> turn silver. All the plants, all the flowers. Immediately? Yeah. He's uh, He is a god himself, Gratz, and he is now in... Her domain? Yeah. Fuck! <laughs> oh, fuck, uh, I should have contacted her. We're gonna end it there. Uh, how the fuck can we do that mm. in the door? Mother God, what the fuck? They're gonna start contesting for this territory now. This is... He's coming to another God's domain, which is not usually possible to be brought in here. Oh, God. I'm gonna see what happens. Fuck. She's gonna be so mad at us. <laughs> this is all fine. This is okay, she's, she's, she's always mad at us. No, she's not. No. No, this will be fine, because, like, the, the everything's ending. Like... It's fine, if everything gets destroyed, you know, you gotta put the reset button on it anyway, but yeah, in my head, I was like, okay, shit, if he goes to someone else's domain, I don't think that's usually possible, but if it was. Interesting. Yeah. I'm, I'm, gonna, have to, I'm gonna make a... I'm gonna make one look roll here, because I actually don't know <laughs> if this would happen or not, or if he would just get catapulted back out immediately. Uh, I'm gonna roll d20. We're just gonna see. Uh, you know, high is good, low is bad. I'm gonna figure a roll up. There's not enough space there. There we go. That is a six. Oh, he's with us! This is gonna be fun. I'm not saying I prefer this, but I prefer this. <laughs> <laughs> All right. all right there we go all right there thank you all for playing thank you very much uh, and thank you gabriel oh my pleasure for for running two sessions <laughs> yeah it was two, two that was a two hour session it was a five hours we played all together now or something like that <laughs> yeah. something like that yeah five, six, six hours exactly. six hours six, yeah. yeah six yeah exactly. I got a dart because I got to get to the shop before uh, it closes because he's going to close soon. I got to do my weekly shop. Bye. Thank you everyone Bye. for watching. Catch you later. Thank, Thank you so you much. Thank you for watching. Bye. Thank you. Pleasure. Now. There we go. This music's great. I'm not sick of this music. No, it's true. It is fun.